Hey guys, Light in the Darkness here. And, well, as you can hear, we are getting ready to start something. It sounds like a golden skull shell, doesn't it? Uh oh. Hold on. Doesn't it? Well, it's actually. There we go. This. Now, there are two methods to killing Goma. And stunning her. Well, stunning her. The one I just used. And then you'll see this next one here soon because I'm gonna try to shoot her. Where she legs her eggs? Crap. Crap. But the other method is slingshot her to death. <laughs> then there you have it, guys. Within about maybe a minute. Goma is down. I lost more hearts than I would have liked to, but we saved the Great Deku Tree. Or did we? Then we gotta go to the heart container. Step out in a flight, and then you return to where the Great Deku Tree is. Well done, Solar. Thou hast barely demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wast, wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? Sure. Now listen carefully, a wicked man of the desert cause cast this dreadful curse upon me. Hmm, he looks familiar, doesn't he? This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorcerer's powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to higher rule. For it is in that sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Before time began, before spirits and life existed. Three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, Nehru, and Beore. Din, the goddess of power. Nehru, the goddess of wisdom. Beore, the goddess of courage. Din. With her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the Red Earth. 
Nehru poured her wisdom into the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Fail Barari Barar with her rich soil produced life forms who would uphold life itself. The three great goddesses, the labors completed, departed to the, for the heavens, and golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of the world's providence, and the resting place of the triangles has become the sacred realm. Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred Triforce. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me has sapped my, and sapped my power because of that curse. My end is nigh. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you started. Yes, I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Solar, go now to Hyrule Castle. There thou wilt surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Take the stone with you, the stone that man wanted so much that he cast the curse on me. Well, with that, folks, we have the first spiritual stone, the Kokiri Emerald. Well, my shadows, what do you think of this? You got the Kokiri's Emerald. Emerald, this is the spiritual stone of the forest. Now entrusted to you by the Great Deku Tree. Great Deku Tree. It's easier to say Deku than a Deku. The future depends upon thee, Solar. Thou, thou art courageous. Now be the fairy. Help Solar to carry out my will. I entreat ye. Now be good. Bye. Let's go to Hyrule Castle, Solar. Goodbye, Great Deku Tree. I never know that Navi stays behind for a second. And now we have another person in front of us. Hey, Solar, what did you do? The Great Deku Tree, did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. Whose fault is it for not letting you in on time? Not mine. Maybe yours, Mido? I don't know. So now let's go see what that other sign is. Because if you remember in the last episode, there was a sign that we couldn't read because I accidentally chopped it up. I believe that's the one that's saying, hey, do a spin attack on me and I'll give you something. Cut grass with your sword. If you swing your sword with B, you'll cut horizontally. If you hold Z as you swing, you'll cut vertically. What is it, Na Navi? The Great Deku Tree wanted us to go visit the princess at Hyrule Castle. Shouldn't we get going? Ah, uh, yes, if you insist. I was just, I wasn't biding my time, so. I lost wood, day. This isn't so lost, there's a bridge connecting me all the way through it. 
Oh, you're leaving. She says with a stoic look on her face. <gasps> I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Solar. Because you are different from me and my friends. But that's okay. Because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please, take good care of it. You received the fairy ocarina. This memento from Surya. This is a memento from Surya. Set it to C and press C to start playing it. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to C right. I mean C left, C right, C. I mean C left, C down, C right, and press that C to start playing it. You can play different notes with A and the four C buttons. Press B to quit playing or start your song over again. When you play my ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to visit the forest. Hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, I don't know. Oh, the always silent protagonist. Always silent. Except when he screams in pain. Welcome to Hyrule Field, folks. As you can see, we saw, just saw a pea hat. Can't kill those yet. Oh, look, Kabura Kabura. Hoot, hoot, hoot. So, Lori, it appears, it appears that time has finally come for you to start your adventure. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel this courage even during the toughest times. Go straight this way and you will see Hyrule Castle. You will meet a princess there. If you are lost and don't know which way to go, look at the map. The areas you have explored will be shown on the map. Press start to enter the subscreens and um, Z or R to find the map. On the map subscreen, you will see you will also see a flashing dot showing which way you should go next. Did you get all that? Mm, yeah, I got it. All right then, I'll see you around. Hoot 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 hoot. I don't know. Honestly, sometimes things just come to me while I'm making these videos. I'm going to try to take a shortcut so we can get into Hyrule Castle as soon as possible. Because if you have played this uh, or Ocarina of Time 3, you know that the sun's about to set. If you don't hurry, you're kind of screwed. Ah! Go, Link! Go, 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 go! Almost there, Gron! All we have to do is make it onto the bridge before they start putting it down. Now I'm gonna stand here until they bring it up. There we go. We made it. Now, as promised, I will show you an easy way to fill up your roofy wall with that as a kid. Come in here. Smash the heck out of these pots. Now, you may not realize it, but in one of these crates, there is a Skulltula. And which one? You may ask. Obviously, viewers, you'll be asking, might ask this in the future. This one. This is going to pop the break.
They cause one damage? I forgot about that. Um, and one of these crates holds rupees as well. Holds a rupee as well. And there it is. My, 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 that kind of hurt just a teensy bit. But, um, let's move on. That's the easiest way to fill up your wallet. I'm actually gonna... What is that beautiful noise? Oh, it's Malin! Is the Happy Mask Shop open? Happy Mask Shop now hiring part-time. Apply during the day. But what you have to do, actually, she's important. Hey, your clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. My name's Madeline. My dad owns Lawn Lawn Ranch. Dan went, Dad went to get, went to the castle to deliver some milk. But he, and he hasn't come back yet. Hmm. I wonder, what is good old Talon doing? And there's Hyrule Castle, soon to be a certain somebody's castle in the future. And once again, Ubera Kabura. Hey, Solar, this way! The princess is inside the castle! Just ahead, be careful not to get caught by the guards. Hoot! On the ground, time flows normally, but time stands still while you while you are in Lon Lon Ranch or in a town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Well, 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 which way are you going to go now? You want to hear what I said again? No. You're a smart kid. Good luck then. Woohoo! Now, you know I don't know it, but in this... One, two... If I can hit it... Bingo! There's another golden skull to off. Now, you could go that way and pay rupees, but why would you do that when you can just... Gotta get caught a first time anyways. There we go. I'm like, why is it why am I not climbing? You have to get caught the first time. So the easiest way to do this. Hurry, I got it. I don't wanna to have to wait 24 hours, I guess it's gotta... Hurry, 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 hurry! You got a weird. It feels like there's something moving inside. Set it to see and see what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know this already. It should be hatching once it's actually daylight. And there you go. With our speed and timing, we actually got the egg to hatch before we even made it to Talon. But the easiest way to not get caught, jump down here, come over here, I've discovered a certain path you can take. Most people will pay 10 rupees, I'm trying to save those. Come over here, to the corner where that is, a little further, come this way, turn over here.
And as you can see, I'm not getting caught. You gotta be careful, though. Because if a guard even spots you or you go behind the guard, you can get caught. Now I'm going to try... And it's always good to check the trees. Because you never know if rupees or anything will be in them. Everything important will be in this corner. One darn agent! Can't a person get a little shut eye around here? Hello, and who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, along with our Long Non Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest, and I guess I fell asleep. What? My mom was looking for me. I got it. I'm gonna catch it. catch it from him now. I messed up bad, leaving Malin. God, why am I giving him giving Malin behind leaving Malin behind to wait for me? She's really gonna let me have it. She's really gonna let me have it. Yeah, I didn't. I just don't know why I gave him a Boston accent, but whatever. We're kind of gonna ruin their milk a bit. Actually, I've got an idea. Crap. We gotta wait another 24 hours, folks. Unless well, I can jump in after I get this in fast. Go, 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 go. I barely made that. I barely made that. Oh, I didn't make it at all. So I'm just gonna stand here till it's time till I hear the crow call. <laughs> In fact, I'll pause it for you folks so uh, that you don't have to stand here waiting. And here we go. Uh, this is actually a stealth mission. I'm the creeping bushes. Don't look. Now don't be tempted by the rupees over here.
it's this is the symbol of stalking this guard all the way down. Basically, what we're doing in this episode is we're gonna learn two ocarina songs. First, those is lullaby. Then we're gonna learn the sun song. Who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? Oh, what's that? Is that a fairy? Then are you? Are you from the forest? Then... Then you wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, which is that green shining stone? Do you have the... Do you have it? Yes. She'll call the guards on us if we say no. Just as I thought. I had a dream. In the dream, a dark, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. But suddenly, a ray of light shot out of the forest parted the clouds and lit up the ground. The light turned into a figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy that someone would come from the forest. Yes, I thought it might be one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? Solar. Strange, it sounds somehow familiar. Hint into the past Zelda games. Okay then, Solar. I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please, keep this a secret from everyone. Okay. It, the legend goes like this. Basically the same legend we heard before, but actually more in depth. The three goddesses hid the Triforce count containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. The power to grant the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hand. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule to a golden age of prosperity. If someone with an evil mind has his wish granted, the world will be consumed by evil. That is what has been told. So the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforce from evil ones. That's right. The Temple of Time is the entrance through the which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. And in order to open the Door of Time, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with this legend. The Ocarina of Time. Did you understand well the story I just told you? Yes. That's great. I forgot to tell you. I was spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man in there. Will you look through the window at him? Yes. I'm probably a little angry all the time. Can you see that man with the evil eyes? That is Ganondorf, the leader of the Gerudos. Gerudos. They hail from the desert far to the west. And though he swears allegiance to my father, I am sure he is not sincere. The dark clouds that covered the hi covered Hyrule in my dream, they must symbolize that man. What happened? Did he see you? Don't worry. He doesn't have an idea what we're planning yet. Yes. 
I told my father about my dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I can sense that man's evil intentions. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than a tri the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And he wants to conquer Hyrule. No, the entire world. So, now, we are the only ones who can, op who can protect Hyrule. Please. Okay. Thank you. I, I am afraid I have a feeling that man is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such terrifying power. It is un it's, but it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get to the Triforce. You know, at this part, I've always wanted... I've always wondered if there was a glitch where Ganondorf would just be... Would just Go up to the window and be like, here's Johnny! Stick his head, just smash his head through the window and say, here's Johnny! Well, here's Ganon! Sort of type of thing. That would have been hilarious. Shut up. I will protect the Ocarina of Time with all my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Well, let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm sure it will be helpful to you. As you can see, the chicken turned into Zelda's letter. Wow, this letter has Princess Zelda's sign has Princess Zelda's autograph. Set it to see to show people. We know how the select item subscreen works, folks. What I'm going to do now, though, because we're going to need it. We're going to do three things, it's been, two of which are mainly side quests. We were, we're right now going to learn Zelda's Lullaby from Impa. I am Impa of the Sheikas. I am responsible for, protect, for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. You are, you are a courageous boy. You are heading out on a big new adventure, aren't you? My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one with, from the forest. This is an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. I have played the song for Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There is mysterious power in these notes. Now, listen carefully. I will translate them real quick. Delete home page down, delete home page down. Zelda's lullaby. If the castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble. Let me lead you out of the castle. <laughs> you brave lad, we must protect this beautiful land of Hyrule. Take a good look at that mountain. That is Death Mountain, home of the Gorons. They hold a spiritual stone of the spiritual stone of fire. At the foot of Death Mountain, you will find my village, Kakariko. Kakariko? I don't know how you pronounce it. That. That is where I was born and raised. You should talk to some of the villagers there before you go up Death Mountain. The song I just taught you has some mysterious power. Only royal family members are allowed to learn this song. Remember, it will prove your connection to the royal family. The princess is waiting for you to return to the castle with all the stone with the stones. All right, we're counting on you. I want to learn how to do that, honestly.
But now, as you can see, with the with Ocarina in hand, we are going straight to Kakairoko Graveyard, first off. Then, we're going to do a little sort of side quest minigame type thing. Um, you'll see. It's basically we're going after the first bottle. Then we're gonna we'll, we'll learn the sun song, go after the first bottle, and then how many sculptures do I have right now? Five. I think I can get the last five here. But the cuckoo side quest, the foul side quest, kind of difficult. You see these cuckoos running around all over the place. Well, this lady Angie over here can't get them. But first, nothing in there. Um, we're going to learn the sun song. You can get this as either an adult or a child. But getting it as a child helps a lot with the story plot, especially raising cuckoos and stuff. And in this version, though, unlike the very first one, there is actually a fairy fountain somewhere in this graveyard. This is actually the Triforce symbol that we are standing on. There we go. See, there it is. There's the Triforce. For this part, though, I suggest you have this in hand. He carry the keys in a timely fashion. Now, you see there's two unlit torches, but there's not a lit torch around. Well, this is where you come in as an adult, where coming in as an adult comes in after you beat the water temple. Don't worry about taking a little damage in this place. It's easier than actually getting stuck between the, on the re-dead. This poem is dedicated to the memory of the dearly departed members of the royal family. The rising sun will eventually set, and newborn's life will fade. From sun to moon, moon to sun, give peaceful rest to the living dead. This is an interesting poem, huh? Something is inscribed on the tombstone. It's the secret melody of the composer brothers. Page down and home, page down and home. Translated. Mm. 
Now you might ask, why can't we just use these torches? Well, kind of can't open the door to do so. Plus, those unlit torches are on high. You've learned the sun song. Now, I'll show you a neat little trick with this. Restless souls wander where they don't belong. Bring them calm with the sun song. Basically, give us a hint. Break out the ocarina yet again. Step into this room. I was actually hitting page up instead of page down. But as you can see, they're par they're paralyzed for right now. So we can take the safe path. If we're fast, don't attack them or I'll become unparalyzed. And now for the final part of this episode. I'll take care of the golden school jewels on my own time. Well, actually, no, I won't because I have to show you our location. Is Dompe out? Yes, he is, so I gotta turn it today. You'll know it's nighttime when you're in the graveyard when Dom pays out when he's a well during being a kid anyways. <laughs> There's certain heartbeats we can get right now too. But I'm gonna take care of the hardest to get Cuckoo's first. N you'll see what I mean by hardest to get. What you gotta do is you gotta take this cuckoo up, bring it over, toss it before you might drop down with us. So, yep, it, that one dropped down with us. So be careful over here because there's a hole with how glitchy this is. If you fall down the hole, those cuckoos that you already put in put on the other side will be released. So you gotta watch it. Let me show you a quick shortcut though. It might not look short, but actually it's easier than going all the way around. Jump over here. Right as you reach the pen. It'll fall in. There's one. Now I was gonna say the other two should be around the same area. Now that we can't just fly over to 